So, uh, what we're doing today, uh, we are uh, changing uh, one of the wheels. This is uh, was a temporary fix. Is one of the front wheels, and uh, we're also gonna um, point out uh, the importance of having the right tools. Uh, obviously, as you many of you know. Um, my trade is not uh, repairing vans and cars my trade is carbon fiber and that's what i do on a daily basis i contract along the country and uh, i have a limited company and that allows me the freedom to uh, do a lot of interesting stuff uh, working within formula one airspace motorsport and automotive not as much lately uh, we got a bit out of the routine of uh, doing the same thing every day. I think it's a bit boring. Yeah, it's uh, it's exciting when you tell people, yeah, I built uh, McLarens and, um, you know, I built, uh, uh, I don't know, Ferraris, F-150s or LaFerrari as everyone knows it. But it's not as exciting as Formula One or as uh, aerospace or I'm doing at the minute. Uh, or Groundworks. Um, telecommunication and satellites uh, as a DIY and hobby I do this on my spare time as you could see we repaired the seals and they seem to be holding okay but uh, on the old van now we got a problem with the doors obviously the rust is going up and more in our old Vito and um, we obviously acquired for our driveway repairs these uh, amazing 2.5 ton rated aluminium steel racing jack which is amazing I can tell you I've used it a handful of times already it's quick goes up uh, effortlessly it goes down in, a, in, in um, a couple of seconds it's very good um yeah uh, i've decided to use the piece of wood so i don't ruin the jack because the the stands are not still ready on the van um i try to use this uh little um 100 mil uh, wide by uh, 50 uh, carbon plate i've uh, done at work um this is solid carbon as you could see but it wouldn't fit in there properly so uh, it kind of damaged it here a little bit but that's nothing so uh, yeah um 2.7 ton and it uh, managed to lift it that shows you how strong carbon is and why everyone is so keen and uh, dear to use also we got the braking bar as well we thought it was necessary because our torque wrench was busted and as important as it is as well uh, we got a brand new set of this um, uh, key uh, for the uh, braking bar, 19 millimeters, so they don't damage the wheels, which are already damaged, but we're going to refurbish that. Also, another thing that we're going to do today is a little refurbishment on the disc. The van's been sat here for quite a bit of time now. It's been about six months now, hasn't been moved, and the discs, they were brand new, but now they look like this. So we're gonna do a little refurbishment on them, and maybe the calipers too. So stick with us till the end. Um, hit that uh, subscribe button and that uh, bell for the notification so you don't miss any of the videos, and that would be a big help for the channel. Thank you very much. Keep on watching. So, step one, drill with a wire brush. Also a manual wire brush for the places where the drill can't fit. Um, take the pads out, take the caliper out. Um, obviously, take your sensor out because you don't want to rip it off. Uh, so that's a uh, small bolt that sits on here um, with a six millimeter allen key just comes out pops out and very simple job i'm not going to get on to there's a lot of videos uh, to show how to remove a caliper i'm not going to get onto that and once you do that make sure you wire brush it with your drill very well and uh, we will proceed to do that and then uh, go on to the next steps um, 
and paint it and we'll show you the end result right here we go ladies and gents it was getting a bit late and dark but uh, that is the end result uh, caliper paint and let's see if it focuses yeah that's it and um, as well the discs now I know some of you will start saying yeah you painted the disc and uh, all that but uh, I really didn't have the time or the will to take the disc out and tape it all around and plus um, uh, it's it's gonna come out with a razor blade very easy um, before I even uh, go anywhere with the van so uh, yeah this is the end result I think it looks very good um, considering it's a very old van and caliper also we took that red ugly tip exhaust and uh, we fitted a nice uh, our cup of the tip uh, on carbon fiber and uh, yeah we're gonna see more details like this coming on onto our little van and also onto the mercedes uh cls that at the minute it's just sitting there uh, also there will be a new addition to the channel if you want to keep on following under this cover uh, yes I don't know how many of you guessed already but um, this is a 911 uh, it's a 986 uh, 1998 model um, and yes you guessed it it's just a shell it's not a whole car so um, it's gonna be a big project stay tuned click that uh, subscribe button that uh, notification bell so you don't miss the next videos and also you will be able to see what we are going to do with this uh, so yeah new addition on the channel big surprise uh, big things coming up and they are planned stick with us and uh, you will be surprised